Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another episode of the non cooperatives We are continuing with some more Last Stand, uh... What's this one is this? <laughs> Last Stand Union City. Okay, so we're in the middle of a, uh, of an actual mission right now. We're supposed to be... I completely forgot where we were, because honestly, I, it took me... Uh, I, it's been a while since I've actually played this game. Uh, we're trying to find, ha uh, find Hank's dad's rifle. Hank's rifle and rifle bolt. So I'm guessing it's like two, it's a two-part thing. I completely forgot what we were doing and I forgot where we were. So I don't know where we're supposed to be looking at, actually. Holy shit, that's not good. Uh, oh, excuse me. I didn't even have dinner. Not even any dinner. Maybe I, maybe I actually did come through here. You guys are probably going, you motherfucker, you just came through there. Cause you guys probably, oh, oh, hey, hey there. How you doing, buddy? I'm just gonna just pop you in the middle there. Oh, oh, you just fell. Oh, oh, fuck me. No, 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 I'm playing cocky. No cocky. Okay. Space bar to shove enemies. There was a, okay, that's what it was. It was a Q to switch weapons. And R to reload. What gun are we even, I don't even know what gun we're even using. Oh, it's an Uzi suppressed. I'll take it. And the transport device that comes in. Uh, book and a magazine, I feel like those are useless. Um, jeans, and sunglasses, yeah, why not? Boots and pants and 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 boots and pants. Oh my god, you fucking freak. Holy shit, I can't even, my god, I could, yeah, it wouldn't even let, let me, uh, uh, yeah. That shit. <laughs> I can't, I couldn't think of it. Let me just see what this is. There we go. Let's try that gun out. I, I mean, I don't know if I'm if I'll be good with it though because of the fact that like I'm uh goes all over the goddamn place. Uh, candy corn. Cause I just want to get some, my health up a little bit. Some oranges. And that's it, right? Yeah, not too much. Right. Oh, I get I get jeans. I want to wear some jeans. Actually, I'm aren't I already wearing? I'm wearing blue pants. No, I'm wearing I am wearing blue jeans. So, <laughs> well then. Damn. How about the camos? Ah, uh, those aren't cool camos. Well, I mean, they're cool as I... Look, I wore them back in the 90s, alright? Those types of, you know, that uh, white type of camos. Yeah, I wore those. Did I enjoy them? Not really. I don't know. I guess it was just something that wasn't... It just wasn't me. Bottle of soda. And he's twitching! Stay down, motherfucker! <laughs> I'm sorry, I was going to tell me a key thing that was from a... Oh, damn it. Too much weight. I keep forgetting about the... Freaking exceeding all weight bullshitness. Um, what can I get rid of then? Get rid of the fucking shovel. What am I, how am I gonna do? It's not showing to the dead. So, pocket knife sharpened, sharpened. We can get rid of one pocket knife. We can get rid of one. I don't know why we kept this. I, I think I was enjoying the hatchet. Or, or was the hatchet. Oh, the knockback was better, apparently. Yes. Cricket stick. Cleaver. Uh. I don't want to get rid of it. You know what it is? I, I, I feel like that, I think I mentioned this before, but I feel like that I, I, I was supposed to pass by something, or someone rather, and uh, they were supposed to be like, oh yeah, I'll, I'll take all your, your, I'll take all that stuff that you got there and uh, I'll, uh, I'll buy it from you or something, or something, something, something. Round, sunglasses round, regular sunglasses. Oh, let me get the round sunglasses. I don't know. I feel like those seem a little bit better for me or my style. We are supposed to be, because well, we have money. We do have money, so if, uh, apparently we are supposed to be buying shit, or we can. We have the option to buy shit. So I'm thinking, obviously we can buy shit. Can we sell shit? Holy shit! Oh damn it! Fuck! Fuck! No! 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 Get away! Get away! No! I'm gonna die! No! Get away! Get away! Get away! Get away! Get away! Get away! Okay. I'm not even gonna ask what happened, but apparently that I fucked up so badly that I went in there. Oh no! No no no! 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 Is this because that I Is this payback for what I just did? Wow, he is terrible. Like I'm missing every goddamn shot. Get the fuck away! I'm really loading! No sweat. No sweat, guys. No sweat. As I was saying, 
was that like payback for what I just did? Because I went in. No, no. Here's what I did. I, I'm not gonna do it. I don't want to do it. I pressed E. I went out. Then I went back in. And I'm like, oh god. And I went out. But when I went back in the the, the second time, there were, the zombies were gone. You know that big giant group of zombies. So. I guess it's a like you know some secrets to like actually learn from this game that like oh you get you get into a tussle like that get the fuck out or you know do your thing where you just get out and go right back in. Um, I'm trying to remember the um. There you go, the hoodie. I'm trying to remember from our uh, the the guy that we played as. Wait, is that? Oh uh, no, I don't want to wear that. Oh, it's not really that good. The guy we played as, he wore like a jacket or something. He wore a hoodie and a jacket, I think. Oh, I could be entirely wrong. I don't fucking remember. Oh, it's been a while since I've actually played uh, the first last stand. Alright, so something is exceeding our weight. Sawed off shotgun. What's custom stock? I'll, tr I'll try it out. Let me okay. reload first. I feel like I should get rid of all these damaged weapons. Yeah, but I like the 1911. It's cool. That's like the only 1911 I probably- I probably have another one in my- in, in the thing. Uh, what's my weight, though? I'm 93 pounds. Well, I'm- I'm, I'm 3.1 over- over the weight limit. So, drink the fucking soda bottle. Oh, Jesus, that's gotta hurt. No, seriously, have you ever, like, chugged soda? Yeah, it's not fun. At all, whatsoever. Alright. Reload. Eh, you gotta reload every friggin' individual shot, that's right. Where the hell is Hank's pest? Back the fuck off! I'll take the cash. Pipe, nope. Ammo, yep. Is that it? Oh, I got Oh, how do you. Ah, shit, how do I do this? Push pin and hold pin. There we go. Like, it was a little, like, getting to me. Like, how do you do it? How do you do it? Where's Waldo? <laughs> I don't know why that's a book. All right, uh, like, that's, like, a, a book you can, you can, uh, that, that, that helps you, uh, um, level up, I think, right? Like I said, it's been a while since I've actually played this game, so I'm... Where the fuck's the book? Shit. Um, we have to level up, right? How do you... There you go. Can we even... Can we even level up? I, I am... Jesus, I just completely forgot how to play this game. That's that's all what it really is. Like, I played, what was it, three episodes all in one sitting, and now I'm back, like, uh, I was gonna say years later. I'm back... To me, it, to me, it's, it's, it's weeks later. To you guys, it's just a couple of, uh... I don't know, but it's been a, it's just been a week. Oh, here we go. That's what it was. It was all in the uh, in the health. I, I don't know. Okay. Big glasses. Damn it! Damn! 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 How are you missing? Seriously, it's like the uh, fucking what the hell's his name? Oh my god, I can't remember his name. It's like um. As a comedian, I can't remember his name though. It was like Stephen Blum, Stephen. No, not Stephen Blum. Stephen Blum's the um. Oh shit. Stephen Blum is the uh, boy, is the the man with a thousand voices. He does famous voice actor. Does the voice of Spike Siegel from Cowboy Bebop. I'm actually not liking the shotgun too too much. I'm gonna swap out. Uh, let me go back to either. No, I'm gonna go back to the Uzi. Try that out again. Stephen Blum is the voice actor who's got like the man, the man with a thousand voices type of thing. He voices like all these uh, characters. He's more uh, famous for being Spike Siegel from Cowboy Bebop. But the the uh, oh my god, oh my god, what, what the hell's his name? Stephen something the comedian was saying that he wanted to get a gun because he was terrified. Oh hang on, Rox. And uh, went looking for Tommy. No, 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 no. Don't come back looking for us. I'm sorry. I tried. Love John. Is that a dear John note? I'm gonna take this. Yes. A damaged AK-47. Oh, son of a bitch. 
What does that mean we can't use it? Wait, let me see. And we gotta, obviously, we gotta, we gotta, like, you know, loosen up a little bit. Some chips. A water bottle. And we're still too heavy. Damn it. It's definitely, what, what is it that's actually really exceeding the weight? I feel like we gotta get rid of, you know, we gotta get rid of, we gotta get rid of, oh, fuck. Damn it, pantsless! Gotta get rid of a, 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 lot, of, a lot of the doubles. Alright, so what was I saying? Uh, the guy, Steve, Steven, whatever his name is, a comedian, he was, like, saying, like, I gotta go uh, get a gun and everything. And he goes to uh, the gun store and everything. He's asking, look, I don't know nothing about guns. And uh, I really just, I just, I just need, like, a gun because I'm, you know, I'm just, I'm just worried about the, 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 the zombie apocalypse. So he, like, say, I got a gun right here for you. Take this gun right here. It gives him, like, this biggest fucking gun he's got. It's a, it's a fucking shotgun. He's like, you got this gun. It's got a nice spread and everything. You just, all you gotta do is just point. It's got a nice spread. You know, you just, just load one shell up and it's got, it's got a nice spread. He was stressing that a lot. It's got a nice spread. <laughs> you could not stress that enough. It's got a nice spread. It, I can't. Okay, so I can't shoot anything. Okay, damn. Um, he couldn't stress that enough that it had a nice spread and everything. And he's like saying, "Look, like I said, I know nothing about guns, but I, 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 can't, I, I can't take this home and everything. It's, it's a little ridiculous. Like, I just want something like a little bit small, like that little thirty-eight, like that little gun right there, which was a thirty-eight. And he's like saying, he's like, he like waves them off, like, eh." Uh. Like, he was, like, waving him off, like, saying, like, alright, fine, well, whatever. Because, you know, the gun I was trying to give you was actually a good gun. He's, like, saying, look, buddy, I'll sell you the gun, but I'll tell you... Wait, what the fuck you got? Biohazard outfit, check out your storage. What the... Are you exceeding my weight already? Shit, hang on. Just give me one second. <sighs> so he was, like, saying, alright, I'll sell you the gun, but... Have you ever seen those, uh, those action movies where the guy dies behind a, um... Oh, what was it? It dies behind a, uh, um, a couch, and they're, like, in a shootout for, like, 45 minutes, and, like, every bullet misses and everything. That's not what happens in real life. In real life, when you miss, you're dead. When you have this shotgun, it's gonna- Oh, no, 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 no! I'm in the middle! I was talking about a good spread! Excuse you for not spreading enough! Shit, shit, shit. It's like this gun is so less intimidating. Like, I know it's good for, like, it's, this is good, this is, like, good for, like, black operations or, like, sneaking in to, like, uh, to infiltrate uh, met, uh, Outer Heaven or the Metal Gear base or whatever. But, um, because it's, it's, but it's less intimidating. It's like, like having, like, a BB gun. God damn it! Right, let me see this biohazard suit that they offered me. So yeah, he was waving off. I was like, all right, but you know, that's that's what's gonna happen to you if uh, if, if you want that little gun. He's like saying, you know what? Fuck it, give me the goddamn shotgun. So he convinced him <laughs> to take the goddamn shotgun. Did he say in my backpack or in the storage? He probably he probably did say storage. Shit. I was not paying attention. I'm gonna have to like go back and like watch the recording and everything, which I'm not gonna do for like a, for like a while now because I actually want to try to get as many episodes as many episodes done as I can. Shit. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take, take these guys on. See how long I can last. I feel like I'm gonna die. Shit. Okay, we're okay. We're, it's all good. It's all good. Okay, so he gets the shotgun and then he realizes, wait a minute, I can't fucking bring this home to, uh, to, to my girlfriend. She'll have a fit. Dear Jetty, uh, if you're reading this, I fear my life will be uh, will soon end, and I know the chances of finding this note are very slim. Please don't worry about me. Just trying to get the kids out of Union City. Know that I love you, and the kids really don't. Uh, John. That's that's not the same John, right? Because he was talking about uh, Roxy or something like that. So unless he's got something on the someone on the side, then there's a there's a d domestic dispute going on. That's actually not 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 cool. We definitely gotta get rid of something. Anyway, wait, what type of shotgun is this? So say it's the same it's the same it's the same fucking gun. At least it looks like it. The accuracy is better. Fuck it. Like I said, the only reason why I wanna keep these guns is because I want to fucking sell them. And I feel like that right, am I ever gonna sell am I gonna have the opportunity to sell them? This is a waste. Where the fuck is Hank's gun? Can you, you could just, buddy, 
I'm finding all these goddamn guns. Just take one of mine. Just take it. It's, it's, it's fine. Just take it. So he goes home. So he realizes he can't take that home to his wife, uh, his girlfriend. So he's like, damn it. So I gotta return this, and I can't get it, and I can't get a gun. Uh, but later, uh, later on, his girlfriend is saying we have to get a gun because we're about the zombie apocalypse. So she's reading up on guns and everything. So he's all into that. He's like, all right, cool. But she, the, but she's reading way too much into it. Oh, hang on. Nina, everything just went to hell in the apartment. Just got, uh, just got wrecked. Uh, da -da -da -da, but you're not going to find me here. Leave all you can. Just uh, leave across the sea now. Goodbye, Nina. Love, Chris. Really upsetting. There we go. It's got to be in here. Ooh, it's got a fedora. I so want to wear that now. But I want to try it on at least. Oh, whoops. Where's the fedora? Because I know he gave me like a... Ah, oh, man. Yeah, pseudo jacket, which is this. So I'm guessing it's gonna match with, with this. Yeah, sexy. But nah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go back wearing my uh, survival bullshitness. However, I gotta get rid of some shit. Can we heal up without healing 30% health? Eh, let's save that for later. Pickles. Why pickles? I'm I'm not even you know. Never mind. I digress. Anyway, oh well, that's lovely. So, axe rifle somewhere amongst this mess. Great. So his girlfriend is reading up on guns and everything, which is cool because now he's into now he's up for that. Um, but she's reading way too much into it that she's like saying, "Oh, when we buy a gun, we gotta hide the bullets." And um, <laughs> hang on, we got when we got a gun, we gotta hide the bullets and we gotta like uh, take it apart and like hide all the pieces all around the house. So it's like, no, I, I want that shit locked, cocked, and loaded right beside my bed. So when an intruder, intruder comes, I just pick it up and boom, that's it. I'm not gonna be running around the fucking house trying to put together a uh, trying to put together a gun, being like, honey, where's the scope? Where's the scope? It's in the room. It's in the living room. He's in the living room. <laughs> I don't know. I just find that kind of funny. But, it, yeah, like, it, like, shit like that is actually kind of true because, like, yeah, I know. You got, like, kids in the house or something like that. Technically, if you do have kids in the house, you really shouldn't have a gun. But I digress. I do know people that actually have kids in the house, and they're, like, they're police officers, they're armed forces members, and they do have a service weapon, they call it. And uh, they just keep it They keep it safe. They keep it locked up or anything like that. I just gotta, I just gotta eat something because he's not gonna pick anything else up. What about, oh, are you, oh, okay, good, good, good. I was gonna say, is Hank's rifle gonna be weighing me down or anything like that? No, it's not. Okay, cool. Is that safe gonna be, is that safe gonna, um, is unlockable? Let's find out. And I'm still goddamn heavy! Next time on the Non-Cooperators, we'll see you guys next week, and hopefully I, I can lose some goddamn weight, and hopefully uh, pick that lock safe. We'll see you next week. Where did you come from, Katnado?